Kia ora, Chrissy back again, and we're going to get into the next two episodes of The Clone Wars. So last time we had the Lost Ones, uh, lots of information about sifo Deus, the Jedi that helped uh, Dooku create the clone army in secret. We also had Dooku uh, showing up and we had an amazing battle with him and Anakin and Obi-Wan. Always love watching Dooku fight. We also had our former Chancellor Valorum uh, give a little bit of insight to an, uh, uh, an assistant that he had that disappeared. Uh, who we found is, and he's gone a bit loopy. Uh, and so now Yoda's like, what, the, what, are we do, what are we doing? What's happening? What's going on? So I guess we're going to uh, continue on with this tiny arc. We are going to do two episodes today. We are doing Voices and Destiny. And then there's only one episode to go after that. So first up, we're going to do Voices. Let's get into it. Yoda. <gasps> Hear you, I do. Who? What? It is I, Qui-Gon Jinn. Oh my god, I had an inkling, but I was like, nah. I am part of the living force, Yoda. Holy shit! <laughs> Impossible. I, eh? I thought Yoda knew about this stuff already. Dooku is not the Sith Lord, merely an apprentice. Master Yoda, your thoughts on these revelations? <clears throat> He's distracted. Lies and mistrust surround us in the Senate, and perhaps even within these walls. The growing dark side endangers us all. <sighs> that that saddens me because I know we're getting closer and closer. There is great turmoil within Master Yoda. Yes, we all sensed it. We must keep an eye on our old friend. Is this. Is it Qui Gon that's got him all worried, or. Did he share some information or something? Master Yoda. Sorry, I didn't see you there. Is everything okay? Spoke with Master Qui-Gon Jinn on Mortis. Did you not? Mmm, <sighs> I remember that. So did Obi-Wan. Mmm. Brother. A, a mind trick formed out of our memories. That's what Obi-Wan believes. Everything that we know about the Force tells us that an individual retaining their identity after death is impossible. Ah, oh, so they don't know about Force Ghosts? <clears throat> Force Ghosts? Rest I need. Yes, rest. Then speak with the Council, I shall. Okay. The voice I hear does not come from within, but speaks from beyond. No, I must if I am alone, or if any of you can hear it as well. Then together, we shall meditate. What is happening? Do they do this all night? You know what? I never realized that that's where the chambers was. <laughs> mm. Nothing. Voice. I did not. Answers we will not find. This may be a deception by the Sith. A possibility we must consider it is. Deceived. I may be. Poor Yoda's having uh, almost a, uh, having an internal crisis at the moment. <laughs> so it's just the fact that he felt, heard Qui-Gon that's making him think he's losing it. <laughs> From my point of view, he is in perfect health. Count Dooku was Yoda's apprentice, and Count Dooku has fallen to the dark side. He cannot be held accountable for Dooku's descent. But they are connected. Whoever the Sith Lord is, he may be using this relationship as a direct link to Yoda. If the Sith Lord hmm. wanted to attack the Jedi Order from within, Master Yoda would be the perfect choice. Oh, they have no idea. I would like to suggest something. A deprivation ritual. Like sensory deprivation? Master Yoda, you don't have to do this. Solve this puzzle, I will. See clearly, I must. Are we going to be able to? Are we going to be able to see what's going on in his subconscious? 
No, this is not the way. Come to Dagobah. The answers you seek are here. Come to the Dagobah system. You must complete what I could not. His vital signs are dropping too low. I want him out of there now. Speak of this to no one. Trust no one. Come to Dagobah alone. Wow, cool, okay. <coughs> oh, buddy. Welcome back, old man. Thought we lost you there. Hmm. Speaking to the dead, I was. Friends, long gone. Good friends. Hmm. How did the procedure go? Yoda seems to be under the impression he contacted the dead and spoke with them. What Yoda claims is not possible. As far as we know. I know. Why shut yourself off from... I fear Yoda is under attack by the Sith. Though... Yeah, you close yourself off to... You gotta have an open mind, man. I am prescribing nothing but bed rest for you now, Master Yoda. Is he gonna, like, sneak out? I will leave you... Will he let them know that he's going to Dagobah? You ask for me, Master? Friends we are? Mm -hmm. Of course. Do something for me. You must. Blamed you will be. <laughs> Take the blame. <laughs> Get him to Dagobah. You escape. Yes. Escape. But you're not in prison. No. <clears throat> but perhaps I am. Why does he seem so cheeky right now? A journey I must make. Alone. The council will not want you to travel at all. Disobeying the council. And isn't it funny that he goes to Anakin to, <laughs> to do this? Now, a walk you will take me on. Some fresh air I require. Uh, I hope I don't regret this. It's funny to see him acting like this with Anakin when he does <laughs> acts like this with Luke, you know? Hey, R2. I have a mission for you. Get him to a ship as fast as possible and get him out of here. Uh, uh oh. What have you done? Hey, for once, none of this was my idea. <laughs> Here I am, ready for my next instruction. Yoda, my old friend, you have come at last. Is this Liam Neeson? It sounds like him. Follow the light. The light will be your guide. Oh shit. Strong this planet is with the Force. It is one of the purest places in the galaxy. Really? I never knew that. I thought it was just, you know, somewhere that Yoda came to hide. From all things that have ever lived feeds into the cosmic force, binding everything and communicating to us through the midichlorians. Know you who the Sith Lord is? I can only show you a place where the answers will be revealed to you. Whoa. Give power to that which you fear, and it will show itself to you. What, is this the, the cave that he took Luke to? What are you going to see? Oh! <gasps> oh my god! Shakti! I remember that from from the movie, right? Joy. There is no that blue lightsaber that went through Shark T was was that Anakin? Such darkness, such evil. And that music. With each day that Clone War wages, evil is growing in its power. Any hope that the Jedi can prevail is there. There is always hope, my friend. Not right now. You have been chosen, as I was before you. You will learn to preserve your life force, and so okay. manifest a consciousness which will allow you to commune with the living. So this is where he learned it. I thought he already knew how to do it. You will travel to one of the origins of all life in the galaxy. The Force will be your guide. Goodbye, my friend. Wow. 
Okay. I loved that. I absolutely love that. Like, you can really tell that we're, we're really getting closer to the turning. I'm really not looking forward to it. That was an awesome vision, though, that he had. So sad. Uh, when I went by, like, I thought that he already knew how to do that. I just thought it was something that natural that, that naturally came to him when he died because, you know, well, his age, you know, how strong he was in the force. I didn't realize it was something that, yeah, you know, that they didn't know already. Um, I guess Qui-Gon was, like, the, maybe the first to, to, to at least do it vocally. And then Yoda learned how to do it, you know, bringing himself forward visually. I don't know. But that was freaking cool. And now I need to get on to the next one because I want to know what's going to happen with Yoda. Where is he going? Where is he going that is the one of the places of what? Um, what One of the places of, the, of life or whatever it was that he said. So we're going to do a destiny. Let's get it teed up. Wow, look at that. Qui-Gon spoke up. I believe this is. Okay. It looks pretty. So, blocking our scanners, the gas is. But inside a planet may be. <laughs> I love R2-D2 screams. That sounds... That sounds bad. Oh, everything's going haywire. Controlling this, are you? Oh, he's fucked too. Let the force guide. I will. Oh. Where we are, I'm not sure. But strong with the force, this place is. <laughs> you hear that didgeridoo? <clears throat> Always love hearing that. From inside the planet, life emanates. A journey for me alone. This is safer. Here you are, my friend. Oh, he's going to take the ship down. Okay. Wow, that is so pretty. Oh. There's got to be life forms down here, right? I mean, this place does exude life. Hmm, or well, animals at least. Look at that. Looking for those who can teach me. The question is... Are you worthy of being taught? Fair enough. <laughs> Bell? Oh, what the heck? You are late. We have been waiting for you, Master Yoda. Now come, we are about to begin. That is so cool. I have a guest. Whoa! You should not have brought him before us. I... is he here? Told I was to learn from you. How to manifest my life after death. He will fail the great gift. He will disappoint us. Well, they all got different faces. But why him? He is to teach one that will save the universe from the great imbalance. For this, the great gift will be his. Wow. Okay. And you realize what you must do, what you must face. No. Good. Then you won't be afraid. <laughs> <laughs> so they knew he was coming and they're going to teach him this because he's going to be the one to teach Luke. Do you come to us with only good intention and light in your heart? Yeah. The blessing I give and the training will begin. Oh no! Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> it's creepy. Okay. Now, what's the test? All that surrounds us is the foundation of life, the birthplace of what Jewish science calls midichlorians. Oh. Life passes from the living force into the cosmic force and becomes one with it. Come with me. 
hope this isn't going to get too technical. On that island dwells all that remains unconquered. Oh, that doesn't look scary at all. A Jedi Master, I am. Mastered my weaknesses and conquered my fears. I am. Well, obviously not all. You must face your evil on that island and defeat it. Okay. Easy. PC. <laughs> That sounds like his own voice. We're gonna get mischievous Yoda. Whoa! Show yourself. Whoa! Yoda hates me. Yoda hates me. <laughs> what the hell is that? It is. It is him. But like a. Yoda, please, not with me anymore. Well, is this like another side of him that he forgot about? Locked away. <laughs> looks like recognizes you not. Looks like Gollum. <laughs> I choose not to give you power. Face me now, or I will devour you. Fuck! <laughs> part of me, you are not. Part of you, I am. <laughs> Jesus, Yoda. Yoda thinks me not worthy. Recognize you, I do. Okay, well, fill me in, please. Part of me you are. Mm hmm. But what part? Through patience and training, it is I who control you. My dark side, you are. Okay. Reject you, I do. I thought it was going to be something a little bit more elaborate than that, but. It was just the dark side of him. You have conquered your hubris. Now face the temptations you must. Oh god, it's not over yet! <laughs> you must enter the valley of extinction. Pass through without That's, emotion. Doesn't sound ominous. When you will see all our faces there. And then you will seduce you. Oh! Anger. And joy and serenity. What could possibly seduce Yoda? Oh, Master Yoda, please. <laughs> I'm I'm dying. Who has done this? The Sith. You told me I would finish. My training. Come on, Yoda, you gotta know this isn't real. Will I still become one with the Force when I die, Master? No, no, not strong enough I was. Dude, you know this isn't real. Failed them all. It's not real yet. <laughs> Come with me and you will never know pain, never know sadness. So this is what will seduce him. Oh, Ahsoka. Ah, Master Yoda. Master Dooku was just telling us a tale of when he was your Padawan. Really quite a humorous story. I was telling them the tale of when you faced the giant Terentatek on Kashyyyk. Is that how you say that name? Terentatek? <laughs> I see it in Star Wars Online all the time, and I never realize how to say it. I'm sure we'd all love to hear more, but it's time to join the others. Oh my god, look, they're all here. Quinn, everything, everybody. Come on, buddy. No. Lies, these images are. Lies. Oh, was that supposed to be Sifo Deus? Or no? On Naboo. Died you did, qui -Gon. Oh my god, it's fucking Qui-Gon. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like I need to go and fucking smack myself in the face. No. An illusion this is. A falsehood. <sighs> okay, good. You have done well. But to succeed, your life must be spent learning. Please, 
Show me who you are. It's a cocoon. Now you see, we have achieved what you seek and live between the realms. Okay. How shall I complete my training? You must face the ultimate test. You will travel to Morbond. Journey to the ancient homeworld of the Sith. Oh. It's all that you fear. Oh, that haunts your soul. So dramatic, honey. Moraband? I always thought Kur Kuraban was. Korab. Oh my god, I can't fucking remember how to pronounce it. Koraban. It is the same! It's the same planet! <laughs> Fuck! A strange place I have come from, but finished not what I came for. Set a course for Moraban. The worst, I fear, is yet to come. I can't wait to see what this last one is. Is the face whatever's going on on Moraband or Koraban? Koraban, known as Pesagam during the reign of Zim. <laughs> Fucking words. And also known as Moraband by the time of the Clone Wars, was the sole planet in the Horoset system located in the galaxy from Chorus Major. So it used to be called Koraban way back in like the old Republic. And now it's called Moraban. I never knew that. <laughs> this was a fucking cool episode. Um, watching Iota having to go through these trials to learn how to become immortal. And again, I am so fucking embarrassed <laughs> that I didn't pick out Quaika. I'm so dumb. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to see what uh, what what's going to happen on this next planet. Um, and I guess, I mean, he, he, he obviously learns how to do it because we see, uh, we see, you know, him do it, you know, come the movies. Really, really loved the dark side Yoda. I thought that was su such an interesting looking, um, dark side creature and the way that he spoke, oh my God, it was really creepy. I never really thought of, uh, Yoda having a dark side. It's just, but I mean, obviously everyone has got that dark, you know, everyone has got the dark side right and they just you know tend to lean towards one or the other um i guess i guess i just put uh i guess i put yoda up on a pedestal you know um thinking that he never has any kind of seductions which was wrong and that he's he never had to wrestle with the dark side oh well but these two episodes were really, really awesome. So we've only got one more episode in this season to go. I can't wait to see how this season is going to wrap up though. Because then I think we're, we're going to be getting into the meat of, you know, things are going to start coming downhill. And I'm not looking forward to it. All right, well, we're going to leave it here for today. Thank you for joining with me. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And we'll see you next time for more of The Clone Wars. See ya.